course. Hey Star Wars fans and action figure collectors, welcome back to another Star Wars The Black Series 6 inch action figure review. This time we're going with a 50th anniversary of Lucasfilm commemorative figure of Qui-Gon Jinn. Uh, this is probably the only one I will pick up. Um, I did pay a little bit extra to get this one because uh, it's just not readily available here in Australia at all. Uh, they were Best Buy exclusives in the US um, and I think a few fan channels and other online retailers may have gotten them i didn't do a lot of research i just i've managed to find one on ebay for a reasonable price and i really wanted to upgrade qui-gon i'll hopefully get a second one to go with my obi-wan and darth maul that i picked up at celebration in chicago so um i will do a little side by side with the existing qui-gon Jin. so we'll take a close look at that and uh yeah so so far i'm really impressed with uh the fact that uh hasbro decided to completely re-sculpt the head um not a complete re-sculpt, but we'll get a close look at uh, what they may have tweaked. So let's crack it open and have a look. All right, here is Qui-Gon Jinn. Um, yeah, I'm actually really, really impressed with this figure. I'm so happy to have this upgraded version of Qui-Gon. He looks absolutely fantastic. Um, would have loved to have seen them use uh, some of the new sort of Jedi you know, body body sculpts. Um, but this one works fine, I think. It's all right. Um, it's going to be nice to just have that sort of increased articulation that some of the new ones have uh, in the shoulders just to bring those lightsaber hands together for a dual grip. Um, from memory, this one wasn't too bad, but it, did, it's, it just struggles a little bit. Um, so I'm going to do my quick side-by-side -side so we can move that other one on. So it looks as though... They've simply just re-sculpted the face. Uh, Hasbro basically said they toyed with the idea of putting the photo reel on this one, but decided against it. Uh, it just wasn't going to work. And uh, I remember when I reviewed this figure when this one first came out, um, I actually really liked the method they did here. Um, it was a one and done situation for this figure. Um, and yeah, the, the head sort of was sculpted separately from the eyes. So, But uh, I much prefer the photo reel version that we have now because that is just absolutely fantastic great likeness to Liam Neeson especially when you just get the lighting and the shadows right it's just absolutely spot on absolutely fantastic but the rest of the figure is more or less the same Maybe some slight differences in the weathering and some coloration, but that's about it. Um, it doesn't come with the other extra hand that the other one came with. It's just sort of like a um, force mind trick hand. But yeah, it's great to have great to have a new Qui-Gon Jinn that can stand alongside Obi-Wan Kenobi, because um, that is Still today, one of my favourite Black Series figures, the Episode 1 Obi-Wan. So as well, there's his lightsaber hilt. does have a peg on it, and that does just peg nicely into that hole. As so. And it does come with the blade, of course, which is one of those really nice, tight, big, solid pegs. So that holds in there. Quite nice. That ain't going anywhere. And it's not going to break easy because we've had some that have been quite thin. So uh, there we go. That is Jedi Master Qui-Gon Jinn. So glad to have this updated version like I said. A really cool figure. Yeah, so all the same articulation as before. No real major updates there or anything. Just that face. And that makes all the difference for sometimes. The fact that they re-sculpted it to uh, benefit the use of the photo reel paint apps. Got to give Hasbro kudos for that. And the colouring in the hair is a lot better as well. Some slight tinges of grey shading. Because this one was uh, all just one solid colour. So 
So I'd love to hear what your thoughts are on this one. Please drop them in the comments below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do and hit the notification bell so my videos drop straight to your inbox or will be notified as soon as they drop onto YouTube as well. So thank you very much for watching. Really appreciate it. Till my next video, may the force be with you, always. We're a little rushed, so if you'll just get on board, we'll get out of here.